Meta Meta into the start. Is that what I heard? Into the start. So inquire at Meta Meta into the start. Further information uh, to come. Uh, moves in the market. Avantage, the 9320 is now your favourite. The 11 Rondinella is uh, 4.2 to 4.6. Gee, the 5 here, pre defer was as short as 3.3 this morning, is now out to $4.80. That is an interesting move. Shadows cast, 8.50 to 7. The mitigator is uh, 6 to 8. The chosen one is 23 to 11. Germanicus is 16 rock solid. The 7 Kalani is a 41 into 2. Gee, this market has changed. This is a massive change in this market. The early money was all pre-deferred against Avantage. Well, it's gone the other way here now into 3.2. Rondinella hasn't moved, but Freeze the fur has really drifted here, and there's money for Shadows Cast now into $6.50. So I was with the five on top uh, to beat home the two, the mitigator. Concerns with these track conditions uh, for the two. Shadows Cast will run a race, there's no doubt about that, and I was keen on Rondinella, and the money for Avantage is too hard to ignore. They load away for our Group 1, 30 seconds of betting time remaining. Best of luck to all. Uh, in the race with the connections to whichever horse it is. Best of luck, your group one with TV. So ladies and gentlemen, here it is. Our main event, How Nui Farm, Wait for Age, Group One Classic. As the last horses are about to come up into the gates, Avantage, who is your favorite, Avantage at 371.70. It's been bet strongly. Rondinella pre at a mid-four uh, price, 46470. Avantage comes up to an inside gate and the mitigator to come forward. We're nearly ready. This is it, ladies and gentlemen. Stand by for the start. Long run down the back of the track. Sunny skies here. Racine in the Hanui Farm, Wait for Age, Group 1 Classic in a fair line as well. Irish Flame went back just after the start. The Mitigator began well. Southern Kalani's right there. The Chosen One over on the inside as Shadows cast. The Chosen One trapped just a little wide, looking to slide forward now. Uh, pre defer the middle Avantage the inside with one and a half to two lengths. Rondonella Glory Days in Germanicus and uh, Irish Flame after the 1200 metres. The last one, they sort themselves out and the Mitigator Stepping it out now, a length and a half. Kalani second, Shadows cast third. The chosen one fourth and one off the fence. Savantage the inside. About a length pre deferred. Glory days inside of Rondonella and Ice Rain as they run off the back of the 800 metres. And uh, then we've got over on the inside is uh, Irish Flame as they run across towards the Hanui Farm, 600 metres. And on the outside of that is Germanicus. It is the mitigator trying to make all in front now from Kalani second, Shadows cast, the chosen one Avantage travels well, needs an out and pre defer peels, Glory Days tracks those, Rondinella on the move as well, and then Germanicus and as they turn Irish Flame here we've got over on the outside the mitigator, Shadows cast, pre defer over on the outside and Avantage is getting home really well on the inside, and then the chosen one, here Avantage and pre defer, Shadows cast in the middle, having a crack, and the chosen one, but Avantage in front, pre deferred the stable mate, can't get her, and she was brilliant at the mile. Avon Taj got a pre deferred second, Tiakia Quinella third at the line, the chosen one, and then we had the next time Shadows Cast, Germanicus, followed by Glory Days, Rondanella, then Irish Flame, the Mitigator, and Kalani. Too good. Way too good here. Avantage number nine in the hands of Danielle Johnson for Jamie Richards, who runs a one two in the race. And she was simply too good here. Pre defer tried really hard the outside, then Shadows cast and the chosen one. But she really gives her all down to the line. And that is nine from 16. She was outstanding in the Telegraph. She's been outstanding here today. Her stablemate tried really hard, couldn't draw her in. The Chosen one, a big race fresh, and Shadows Cast trying his heart out as well. Loved it, Danielle Johnson, didn't she? Getting onto the line here, but she held and held really well. This unusually shaped mare, but she's got all power to use and use it. She did brilliantly here today. She did.
and she's let down really nicely. She's come along uh, the inside and she's won beautifully. They've run the Cornella Preta first, tried very, very hard towards the outside, but she's scooted along the inside. Libby is here representing the Tiakiao team and look, there was a question mark about the mile, but not today. No, she was so brave um, seeing her go the inside and Preta Fur go the outside. I thought they're going to fight at home. And